Hi, hello, how are you, everybody? I'm so happy that you folks are joining us on our webinar. We have people from actually quite everywhere. It's uh, actually it came from uh, people from Hawaii, uh, people from uh, Hong Kong. Uh, we have people from also uh, Australia. Uh, we also have people from uh, Washington, so quite a bit of different people all over the world joining us. Uh, today we are very happy to share with you basically the uh, eight best drink for uh, diabetes and also pre-diabetic. So that way you have a choice of saying, okay, uh, if I'm diabetic, how can I get this uh, um, drink so I can be better off? So this is something that we could uh, talk about today. That's going to span um, next, you know, hour uh, to kind of discuss. Plus, I'm going to answer all your questions if you do have on the last, uh, um, you know, uh, eight, uh, last, uh, thir uh, the June 13th uh, meeting. So let's see, let me share my screen out for you first. I think this is this screen two, screen two or screen three, two. Can you see me? Okay, good. Now you can see me and I could, Put it up here, the easier you can see. Okay, so anyway, uh, today we're going to talk about eight best strength of diabetic and, and pre-diabetic. Uh,今天我們很高興大家坐在一起,有人說 首先我知道大家都有很多不同的節目,我們也會有很多參與 第一,我想問一問,如果你聽到我講的話,可不可以加一字在那個screen度,一字一字。If you can hear me, I just want to make sure everybody hear me, just put one on your screen, say one, one, one. Yeah, I see a lot of one coming up. Okay, that's good. That's mean you guys are all hear me. Good, excellent. And that would be greatly appreciated. Okay. Uh, first of all, as you know, diabetic is really a chronic disease and you won't get well. All you could do is actually control. But if you don't control your diabetes, you'll be letting your diabetes get worse. You get all kinds of serious diabetic complications. And unfortunately, pre-diabetic will be the same thing. Uh, where you, one of a lot of problems, actually a lot of our customers telling me is, hey, doctor told me I'm pre-diabetic. But they didn't, he didn't give me any medication. I don't know what to do. He just told me, don't eat too many sweets. But on the hand, my sugar can need to go up. And this is a problem a lot of pre-diabetic patients actually face. Now, everyone,糖尿患病者就不会好的。只能控制控制得来,如果你控制不好,就有很多后患症,严重的病发症会出现的。還有很大問題就是很多糖尿患病者 其實呢,如果你係真的控制唔到呢,糖尿病係一個好大嘅問題,因為呢,佢係影響你全身,呢個叫做聽我全身,大血管同細血管。A lot of people besides 
doctor tell them that, are you approaching diabetic? You really need to control yourself. And a lot of people don't realize diabetes actually affect the whole body, your large vessels and also your small vessels. So it's a serious thing. The whole body will affect it. So if you don't control it, it will affect all the blood vessels and blood vessels. 咁其實有咩病發症會出現咧？如果你係糖尿病之後咧，你增加咗你嘅第一心臟病嘅 risk 嗰個風險。如果你控制唔好咧，你個腎亦都會開始壞，咁就要洗腎。應該講啲真實講俾你聽。如果啊、呃、你隻眼係啊、呃、開始啊俾、呃、糖。整到佢眼嘅血管開始啊，即係啊啊，即係塞咗佢咧，咁你就會變咗青光眼啦。咁你會令到你係塞咗你隻眼嘅睇嘅開始蒙啊。咁如果糖尿病嘅人多數會中風啊，一中風之後咧，因為糖尿病咧，佢會整到血壓高，咁你 chance 中風咪高咯。咁呢個又中風咯。但係好多人唔會講嘢，即係話啊個人中咗風啊咁，但係冇講到佢佢咩係糖尿病。咁從埋咗一樣嘢咧。最弊咧，你係好多時咧，你血液唔循環去到底下只腳嗰度啊，咁啲血液循環，咁你又會個腳咧個神經好多問題啦。仲有譬如你唔覺意整損咗佢咧，要割咗腳，因為你會有肩骨炎啊，壞咗腳。同埋再一樣糖尿病咧，係降低你個免疫能力。喺香港啊，喺六個人裏邊死喺 Covid n i n e t 十九咧，即係依家我哋嘅冠狀病毒咧，全部有糖尿病嘅。So I have a whole diamond type. So actually, if you're not taking care of yourself because it affects the whole body, the large and small vessel, it affects your heart, and you can have chances of high risk of heart disease. Now, if you're really not doing well and you not continue to become very bad, you will get kidney disease and eventually will end up dialysis. As I know, I have worked for Baxter International for many, many years. I brought CAP solution, dialysis therapy to Asia Pacific. 50% of my patients are diabetes patients. So imagine that they'll end up, many of them, to go dialysis. Worse said, if, if you know, it got to your eye, it will create uh, diabetic glycoma. Which is called Chang Gong An, and then in Chinese, huh? And then you will start getting blur. You might start losing your eyesight. And I have a a friend, uh, which um, a staff actually had that problem, and he can he can see. And I have a a customer who, uh, just recently has a staff, a same thing. Uh, blood sugar went up way back. It's like three hundred. Went to the hospital, and now eyes are start getting blur. And, and all these problems will occur, and it's really sad that she might lose her eyesight, and nobody wants to have that. Plus, in if you have diabetes, the chances for you to get high blood pressure is high. If your high blood pressure high, what problem you gonna have? You have a high risk of getting stroke. And if you get stroke, that's not good because you're gonna have tremendous expense on your stroke. Uh, being bedridden, recovery time is long, cost of medicine is very high. If your circulation is poor, it goes down to your uh, lower extremity. Net result of that, you are going to end up with a lot of people, uh, if they get injury, actually they have to cut out a feet, and you know, you got gangrene, you never get well, and that is really uh, another very serious health problem. Plus, also, another issue is lower your extremity, uh, lower your immunity. And sad part is many of our uh, COVID-19 uh, people who die, uh, six of them are all diabetes. So net result, the uh, immunity become very low, it can affect your whole entire body. So all in all, you don't want to be in diabetic. If you are pre-diabetic, you want to prevent yourself become diabetes. That is one of the most objective you have to have. If you are now not a diabetic patient, you are a chronic patient. The best is you are not to go to the chronic patient. Because if not, you have the problem of all these problems. In fact, many friends say, if I am not a chronic patient, or if I am not a chronic patient, what is good? What do I have to eat? Because the doctor said not to eat sweet things. In fact, every person has to eat food. 
至於食嘢嗱，上一堂咧六月六號咧就講咗有咩唔好食啦。嗱，今次咧講有咩可以糖尿病嘅人咧係可以飲，或者前期糖尿病咧係可以飲。咁呢樣嘢咧係幫咗你咧，其實有啲 guideline 啦，咁能夠令到你咧就可以更加多啲機會去享受人生。啊 ，lot of people ask me if I'm diabetes or I'm pre-diabetes. What kind of drink I could have? And to be honest, this is people has to drink because you want to enjoy life. And I really understand that you need to have some kind of drinks. 嗱，每一個人人生咧都要飲嘢嘅，就算係糖尿或者唔係糖尿病咧，前期患者你都要飲嘢。咁我飲乜嘢我先能夠啱咧？係令到我唔會變咗糖尿病咧，或者如果我已經係糖尿病。我唔會更加增加我嘅糖尿病，會令到我更加糖尿病差咧。其實第一樣嘢係飲水，好<笑>簡單飲水。點解飲水好重要呢？因為水裏邊係冇糖、冇 carbs， 同埋咧你每個人都係需要嘅。OK， it's very simple。All you gotta do actually yes， water is important because everybody has to drink water。There's no sugar， no carbs， and Also, it will not affect、uh, any of your blood sugar. 啊，但係飲水點解咁重要咧？因為水咧係幫你咩啊？能夠將你口腔係能夠濕咗佢，咁你咧發炎啊，其他都唔會咁差。第二，水係幫助你咧係有水分咧，咁你關節啊嗰啲地方咧先能夠好滑，咁你就唔會有關節嘅問題啦。同埋女士更加開心啦，因為水咧係幫助你咩啊？個皮膚啊潤滑咗佢啊，咁所以咧防止你咩啊皺紋啊。女士啊最中意啊，唔中意有皺紋，依個係好重要嘅。咁仲有咧，其實原來水咧係幫助你腦咧，係如果俾多啲水你咧，你諗嘢都好啲嘅喎。你知唔知啲人如果你去咗一個沙漠嗰度咧？如果冇咗水咧，佢個人全部亂晒龍嘅，諗唔到嘢嘅，所以行錯路都好多人就係咁樣傳傳下傳翻。仲有咧，你要有水先能夠幫助你咧調節嘅温體。如果唔係咧，可以咧係有呢個叫做 stroke 嘅咩咧，行山都有 stroke 啊。嗱 ，a lot of people don't realize water actually help you to moisten your mouth and actually provide the cleanliness to your mouth. A lot of people felt that that is very important because Without water, you actually able to get more infections and so forth. Secondly, you have to use water to lubricate all your joint and also hydrate your skin. And if, for a lady, actually, will be very happy because more you hydrate your skin, you have what less wrinkle. So always drink a lot of water. More water you drink, less wrinkle. You notice. If a lady who is actually pregnant, their skins look beautiful. They are kind of glow, and all the wrinkles appear to disappear. The reason is because the skin is hydrated. Now you also need water to hydrate your brain, and also if you actually is stuck in a desert, you don't have no water, you don't think properly. That's why people get lost and all that. Also very important, body、uh, water actually regulate your body temperature. And that result, you will not be overheat. Like you go walk in a mountain, if you don't drink enough water, you can get heat stroke, and that's no good. Now, 仲有咧，水咧其實好重要嘅。點解咧？好多你好似我哋依家咁嘅年紀啦，如果你飲唔夠水咧，弊傢伙啦，你個鼻邊啊，成大便好有問題。咁變咗嚟講咧，你成日都係哇，好難去廁所喎。咁所以要飲多啲水，尤其是咧，你飲啲好食咗好多 fiber 啊，咁你一定飲水嘅。OK， 如果飲唔水，你鼻變係一個好高嘅。第二，呢個水分咧，幫助你咧係去將嗰啲排泄嘢咧係走咗出嚟啊。咁所以依個係好重要嘅，因為咧你屙擺攞咗水之後，啊啊飲咗水之後咧，將啲排泄出嚟咧，咁你嗰啲邋遢嘢要走出嚟噶嘛。咁第三飲唔夠水咧，因為可能咧真係會將你嘅腎咧係會整壞嘅喎、哦。咁變咗嚟講咧，你如果唔飲唔夠水咧，有咩啊？你個有 kidney stone 啊 
腎石啊，依個係一個好大的問題嘅。咁同埋咧，仲有原來飲多啲水嘅時候咧，你就可能夠咧個肚要滿咗咁樣，咁你又唔可以食咁多嘢喎。咁變咗咧，你又係減埋你磅啦。咁同埋咧，飲酒咧，你飲多啲水咧，佢即刻大撩咗啲酒咧，咁你當然啦，唔會咁容易醉啦。咁同埋咧，你係 exercise 嘅時候，一定要飲多啲水，因為咧你揮發啲水嘅時候咧。變咗頭先所講啲問題咧，可能會出現。So actually, drinking water is so important. Why is important? Because it helps you in bowel movement. Now, if you have a lot of fibers, you eat a lot of fibers, and you don't drink your water, net result of that you might end up with constipation, which is no good for you. Especially in our age nowadays, you have to really push and pack. Wow, that's so difficult. Plus, if you drink water. It dilutes your stomach acid. Net result of that, you don't feel high burn and all the good stuff that will, might come with you. Now, secondly, water you have helped you to flush out all your bad stuff coming out. You can say water is help you detox because you got that better urination, better fecal matter coming out. Your sweat will get rid of all your waste thing coming out. Plus, if you drink a lot of water, it prevent what? Your kidneys don't form it. You flush whatever you have. If they have cal uh, calcification material, flush out your, through your urine. It's all gone out. Plus, when you drink a lot of water, you kind of feel your stomach. So you preload that water, and that result, you might actually start losing weight because you start drinking a lot of water. You get full. You don't eat that much. And then if you drink some alcohol, you drink water. Another thing will be really good is. Actually, dilute alcohol. You actually decrease, you know, your alcohol absorption to your brain, so you get hangover recovery much faster. If you exercise, so important drink water because you don't don't do enough water, all the above problem might shows up because you burn out all the water doing the exercise. But a lot of people said, especially some Chinese people said, I don't like drink water. Is so just not exciting. 好多中人就話：，哇，飲水，但係好寡喎，唔得，好即係唔得特別喎，就係飲水又唔係咁即係咁咁特別啦，冇 wow effect 啦。唔緊要，下一個重要就係飲咩啊？茶。嗱，中國人咧個個都中意飲茶嘅，所以其實咧。飲茶係一個好重要用餐，點解飲茶好用餐咧？因為飲茶咧，原來係冇卡路里，係冇 carbs， 冇碳水化合物，係一個十分好東西。同埋茶有咗好多很好好嘅身體幫助你嘅 benefit 好處嘅。OK， so next people said， e y I don't like to drink water because it's kind of， you know， not exciting。Then what is the next choice? Actually, it's tea. Tea for Chinese and for anybody actually is an extremely good drink. You know why? Because there's zero calories, no carbs. Plus, drinking tea have all sort of health benefit. Okay, one sort of one suggestion, I would suggest you drink ao tea, low shu tea, which has no caffeine, zero caffeine, it will not affect your sleep. It has just relaxing you. It has zero carbs and zero calories. Plus, you drink teas. It actually lower your blood sugar and also decrease your cholesterol, improve your cardiovascular health, and they have all kind of antioxidants. Actually, decrease your aging, anti-aging. Plus, it increase your immunity, which is really Nice, especially in today, there's so many infections. Plus, because you drink tea, low shu tea actually lower your cholesterol and also lower blood sugar. Net result, you also have lower your what high chances of hypertension, less risk uh, of stroke and dementia. So, and with all that, if you are diabetes, you are actually lower your chances to be higher. Uh, complicated diabetes. If you are pre-diabetic, you actually getting less chances of diabetic complication. Now, I have a 
中國人梗係飲茶，因為茶有好多好嘅東西。咁當然啦，去糖茶係一個好東西。點解呢？佢冇咖啡，冇咖啡因嘅。你飲咗呢個茶咧，唔會話啊，我瞓唔到覺，冇依樣嘢嘅。第二，佢冇 carbs， 亦都冇加路里。咁你飲多多都唔怕。第二樣嘢，亦都係有好多好嘅 benefit 咧，係降低你血糖，同埋咧。亦都降低你個膽固醇啦。如果降低膽固醇嘅話，你個心臟咧亦都係好啲啦。因為咧，你心血管咧健康係特別好啲嘅。同埋茶裏面咧有好多 antioxidant 啊，有同埋咧呢個 antioxidant 咧係幫助你抗、啊啊、老化嘅。同埋咧仲有咧，你因為飲咗去糖茶啦，你係降低咗你啲誒膽固醇咧，咁你嘅 chance for 啊！依、这個高血壓咧又低咗喎。當你低咗高血壓咧，個 chance 又誒係會有中風咧，又會低咗喎。咁當然咧，你糖少咗喺個腦裏邊嘅時候咧，第時到老啲嘅時候咧，個風險咧係我唔記得嘢啊，或者你成日都話啊問好多 question 咧，血去唔到腦度咧，又少咗喎。咁同埋咧最重要咧係 decrease 咗，降低咗咧你個 risk。你個風險咧係喺依個啊、呃、diabetic complication， 即係你個嚴重性嘅誒、呃、糖尿病嚴重性裏邊係降低嘅。咁依個係一個好重要，同埋幫助你好多啊、呃、人嘅誒、呃，即係飲茶係好嘅。嗱、呃、有一樣嘢，好多人如果你飲其他茶咧，最緊要唔好落糖，同埋落牛奶，因為糖牛奶兩樣咧都增加咗你嘅咩啊 ？carbs 同 calorie。啊，西人就好中意飲茶咧，要加糖加牛奶嘅。但係飲譬如老舒 t 或者其他嘅中國茶咧，係唔使加糖加牛奶嘅。So most important at the end of the day when you drink tea, really do not drink tea with alcohol、uh, with、uh, sugar and milk, because when you're adding sugar and milk, what can happen is you adding calorie and carbs. Okay. Now also when you drink Lushu tea. You can actually drink it cold and ice. Matter of fact, it's delicious. All you do is prepare the tea ahead of time, maybe night before, put it in the refrigerator, and ice it next day. A lot of my friends in Hawaii, in a hot place, and also in Hong Kong nowadays, they prepare the tea ahead of time, and they drink it ice through the whole day. Got the same effect, lower the blood sugar. And they love it. They said this is wonderful. So this is something that you might want to consider. Drink a tea, also ice. If you want to, <coughs> you can add a little bit of what lime. Just few drop of lime make the tea interesting. You can absolutely do that. Now certainly all of us they say, oh, I would like to have coffee. Now coffee is okay if you drink it black because there's no calories. And no carbs either. However, if you drink coffee, drink it a little bit more might be an issue. There's a reason, because coffee has a different caffeine. It has caffeine in there. It create your heart to have what they call palpitation. I don't know. You realize when you drink coffee, your heart will go boom 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 boom. It give you a fight. And it always have that issue. Many of you guys actually drink coffee will have that issue. Drinking coffee can feel the heart become more pounding more. And there is quite a bit of study. If you drink five cup of coffee, actually you have more chances to have heart problems in the future because over stress the heart, especially at age sixty five. So especially you drink coffee naturally. Do not bring sugar in there. Although you want 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 some small light cream, but on the other hand, I would suggest instead of regular cream, use almond milk or coconut milk, which is actually can be better. Now, also one more thing, there's study now. Coffee actually affect your insulin. What it does is increase your insulin resistance. So net result. Even though you drink the coffee, the insulin you need more insulin in order to absorb your sugar. 
So if you drink only eight ounce or 240, just one cup of coffee a day, that will not affect. But you have more than that, then you have an issue. Like I'm got a fair show, that's a whole jungle. Yeah, Jay got you that jump boy, you know, I got a fair got on that. I know you got your own cops or your car later. Oh, my, you're a tie, you know, it's a high guy, you know, high almond milk. 即係依、这個誒、呃、一粒 almond， 即係杏仁啦，杏仁有奶噶嘛？依家嘢喺 supermarket 有得賣噶啦。咁同埋咧 ，coconut milk 就有椰子奶，亦都可以做落去個誒、呃、咖啡度嘅。其實有一個問題咧，咖啡裏邊咧有咖啡因啊。咁咖啡因咧其實咧係 affect 咗你一樣好特別嘅，你個胰島度誒、呃，如果令到你個胰數誒、呃、胰胰島數咧。有多啲 resistance 嘅時候咧，你好多胰島胰胰島素入嚟嘅，你先將啲糖帶翻落 cells 度。嗱，佢 study 講咧，就如果你飲一杯八盎司一日，即係廿四個 cc 咧，係冇問題嘅。但係多過一杯就有問題。So remember, make sure that you don't drink more than one cup of coffee because it increase the insulin resistance. So make sure. If you、uh, just one cup, definitely it's okay. And if you drink five cups a day, it also affect the heart. That's not maybe a good thing. So, ha! Next thing, actually, oops, sorry, I missed something. Coffee, yes. Okay, it will. Ah,、uh, next thing, a lot of people say, how about carbonated water? Now, carbonated water is a good another choice. Why carbonated water is a good choice because it also has don't have carbs, and is also has no sugar, and it can be a good drink actually. And however, a lot of people don't realize tonic water has a lot of sugar. Especially you drink tonic water with alcohol, man, that will shoot up your sugar, and that's not a good choice. So, you. Want to drink carbonated water? Just drink carbonated water purely, but not with tonic water. Okay. 嗱，其實咧，誒有啲蘇打水咧係 OK 嘅，因為係冇糖，亦都冇卡，係正嘅。但係千祈唔好飲呢個 tonic water， 因為 tonic water 一教酒咧，其實裏邊好多糖嘅。咁嗰個就唔係一個 good thing 啊。咁仲有，如果你係 squeeze 一啲 lemon 落去咧。其實咧，你就加多零點五克嘅卡喺度嘅，咁都 OK 啦。咁但係最緊要咧，唔好飲，即係嗰啲叫做 carbonated water， 好似蘇打一樣嘅咧，咁就唔正嘅。因為飲親蘇打咧就似咩啊？又飲糖水。咁依個咧就令到你又肥啦，同埋咧又 bad for 你個啊 diabetes 啦，同埋 increase the heart attack 啊，好多不同嘅嘢。所以咧，其實咧飲。啊、uh, ，carbonated water OK， 最緊係真係 carbonated water， 唔係 soda water 啊。So if you drink carbonated water， you probably put a little bit of squeeze of lemon in there。There's zero point five grams of、uh, carbs， which is OK。And also， if you drink carbonated water， make sure you don't drink soda。A lot of people misunderstood。Oh， carbonated water， I drink。Your soda is like。Liquid soda, liquid candy, almost like you can、uh, call it that way, and it causes obesity. It bad for your diabetes. Increase your heart attack. So you want to stay away from that. So purely sparkling water, only carbonated, but no added sugar. You should make sure you remember that. Now, a lot of people said, "Gee, you know, I we want to do some drinking. I also want to." Uh, you know, afternoon, and I especially I love cruise. I like to go to cruise, and you know, a lot of people in the afternoon at four o'clock they're hungry, and they want to give you something very good. And you know what they give you? They give you bone broth, and bone broth is very interesting. You know why? Because bone broth is filling a stomach, and also is a lovely, very comfortable drinks. To give you, to help you, to fill the stomach, feel the edge of say I need to eat something, and a very good afternoon or midnight snack if you want to. 
，所以其實咧飲大骨湯，其實你喺 supermarket 咧，依家買一一盒盒嗰啲湯咧，睇下佢 make sure 咧，佢係誒真係誒即係 bone broth 啊，即係大骨湯。咁你可能夠咧煮熱佢，咁咧裏邊咧其實咧係亦都好少 carb 嘅，多數佢一 gram carb 嘅啫。咁變咗咧，如果你夜晚或者四點鐘嘅時候，我想食啲嘢熱熱地咧，夜晚或者臨啊，即係宵夜咧，你可以食飲依啲咁嘅清湯咧 ，will be very good， 因為佢只係一個卡，又唔會令你個血糖降降高。咁依個係一個好舒服，亦都容易去做嘅東西。依個係一個好嘢，因為我坐其實成日都坐。啊，遊輪啊，咁晏晝咧，佢係俾咩咧？俾呢啲咁嘅誒誒 bone broth 啊，大骨湯啦，可能有啲雞湯咁啦，咁係一個好舒服嘅東西嚟嘅。咁呢個可以大家試下。咁啦，有啲人就話：，喂，我好中意飲牛奶嘅喎，因為我牛奶啊幫助我係即係我個一世都咁飲牛奶。咁但係牛奶其實個卡係好高又好肥嘅。咁其實飲咩奶好咧？有個 solution 就係飲依個杏仁奶，其實依家杏仁奶好 popular 嘅，其實你依家喺香港任何嘅 part and shop 都有或者誒 welcome 啊，都要杏仁奶奶買噶啦。咁同埋亦都喺夏威夷啦，啊好多 supermarket、Safeway 啊，全部都有杏仁奶奶嘅。咁其實一個好東西，因為飲杏仁奶咧，你只係一點四個 gram。係一杯二百五十誒二百四十 ml 啦 ，eight ounce 嘅杏仁奶咧係好飲，係好 delicious。咁咧依個係一個好嘢嚟嘅。So a lot of people said, hey, I like to drink milk because I've been drinking milk for all life. Well, but I'm getting to diabetes. How can I do not drink milk? What choice do I have? Actually, it's very simple. It's almond milk. Actually, almond milk is available to many supermarket. I saw it in Safeway. I saw it in all the different supermarket. Although it's slightly expensive, but it's very delicious because you drink almond milk is only 1.4 gram carbs, so it's a very good thing. It's delicious, and also, uh, it is, doesn't uh increase your blood sugar. And the important thing is you need to ask for the uh almond milk with low or non sweetened, so, supposed to be non sweetened. So that way, you truly get the 1.4 gram of carbs to 240 ml of or eight ounce of uh, uh, of uh, almond milk. You get 1.4 gram of carbs. Now, if you don't want to drink uh, almond milk, if you drink the same amount of milk, you know you are drinking 13 gram. Of carbs. In other words, I drink one cup versus 13 gram. You see the difference. Regular milk is 13 gram. Almond milk is 1.4 gram. Big difference. So that definitely help you to lower your carb. But you might say, I don't like almond milk. What other choice I have? Another one is coconut milk. It's only also one gram, same amount. Another one is soy milk. Give you a little bit more is four、uh, gram of carb, and so both can be a good choice. Plus, you gotta look for these milk, which has calcium and vitamin D、uh, fortified. So that way, you can make sure with this milk, you are continue to getting your vitamin and also vitamin D and also your calcium. 嗱，好多人話：，哇！我飲牛奶，但我一世都飲牛奶喎，咁點算啊？嗱，你諗下啦，飲牛奶就係十三克 of 碳酸化合啊合物，但係如果我飲依個杏仁奶係一點四，咁個 different 係好大喎，嚇十三倍咁滯係咪？咁如果你係咁樣嘅話，就真係幫助咗你咧，你血糖降低嘅。咁但係我唔中意飲，即係依個杏仁奶，咁點算啊？唔緊要，仲有一個咧係椰奶，亦都係同樣椰奶就一個 gram 嘅啫，更加好
。如果你中意，仲唔中意饮呢个咧？你饮啊，豆浆，豆浆系四个卡 ，OK？ 嗱，饮呢啲嘢全部喺 supermarket 有得卖嘅，但系重要点咧，你就要有一样嘢咧，系要有。誒睇翻佢依家賣嘅產品咧，有冇啊啊鈣質啦，同埋有冇 vitamin T 咧，誒擺埋入去裏面嘅。咁你要買嗰啲嗱，大多數都有噶啦。依家不過你睇下揀嗰啲有啊含鈣啦，同埋有依個 vitamin D， 咁啊更加好。嗱，好多人咧，老實講，即係我好有朋友咧，都係咁嘅。佢話：哇！我好中意飲酒喎，咁我就中意係要飲啲酒，慢慢都要咁先能夠覺得舒服啲嘅。嗱，紅酒如果你係飲一杯一百四十二個 m i l 即係話一杯咁上下啦，就曬五盎司咧，咁咧就唔係好大問題，因為你只有五 gram 嘅卡，同埋越 dry 嘅紅酒咧就好嘅。A lot of people said, "Hey, you know, I really like wine, or I need to drink some alcohol. How can I not to drink? It's okay. You can drink a little bit red wine because in red wine, if you drink just 142 ml, you have five ounces of carbs. And drier wine has less sugar, is better. Now, I'm gonna give you one story. This is a real story." I did a study with 24 uh, patients and quite a few guys at the end, at 10 o'clock, the blood sugar got up very high. They all went up to like 240, uh, you know, 220, and all the way to 12 o'clock, continue the same. I said, what have you guys been doing? Why is so high at the end of the day? And everybody said, oh, I've been drinking about half bottle of red wine before I go to sleep. Now you drink half bottle of red wine, you just add a lot of sugar because what red wine made of? Grapes. And grapes is very sugary. So when you drink a lot of that, you gotta hit it. You gotta get your blood sugar to go up. And it's not good because that will stay with you the whole night with high blood sugar and screw up all your blood sugar level, okay? So remember, all you can afford Really, at the end of the day, only one glass, five ounce red wine will be perfect. Now, all you enjoy that, you enjoy your whole study. Yeah, by all the talk, yeah, la. Come, could you have man, a man, a dozen of you and you're not going to talk to go away. She more her though, I sub look at sub say, uh, whole go say, man, I will. Oh, my god, didn't I'm go there? You know, could you move my letter? I'm that fun, see, hong jow. 紅酒即係飲幾杯啦，三四杯咁啦。咁紅酒咧，全部將個血糖咧就彈咗好高。當佢彈咁高嘅時候咧，佢哋咧個問題咧就成日都係咁高喎。因為佢嗰個成晚飲嘅，因為紅酒係用咩做嘅？係葡萄做嘅，係糖係好高嘅。咁所以變咗嚟講咧，佢個糖唔要嚟咧就 screw up 咗佢成晚嗰個血糖嘅嗰、那個即係、就是、走勢啦。咁希望咧真係唔好飲咁多紅酒，一杯就夠啦。但係佢唔飲紅酒嘅時候咧，我哋睇翻佢血糖咧跌翻去咩？六啊，同埋六同埋五點五啊。So it's very good. So imagine all my friend who actually drank those wine at the bottom, when they stop drinking, what happened to their blood sugar? It went back to five point something to six, seven, or no less than seven, all within a good range. So why, and this is why they did that, actually they have Abbott Lee Libby to actually measure. So they all had very good result from, uh, you know, not drinking and it, the sugar dropped down. Now, secondly, what happened is, hey, I like whiskey. I really want to drink whiskey. And uh, if not, I like vodka. Now, Actually, spirit is really has no sugar. However, that is not good for you. There's a reason. Now, if you drink a lot of whiskey, vodka, the chances of bringing your blood sugar go up. Uh, not blood sugar, sorry. Blood pressure go up or bring your blood, sugar, blood pressure coming down. And it can worsen your condition and it also affect your liver. 
okay? And so if you are really serious diabetic, it actually can drop your sugar down in such a way that it might, your insulin, it really doesn't work uh, or, or in effect insulin might work. So it create a hypoglycemic situation. So you drink liquor like spirit, you really don't know whether it affect your blood sugar going up or going down, affect insulin. So your uh, you might result with hypoglycemic, which is very low blood sugar. It might affect your real health seriously because you might faint it and so forth. And on top of that, if you drink uh, uh, spirit, a lot of time you will say, I will get a mixed drink. So not a lot of time, the mixed drink, I always have some kind of high sugar content, uh, for example, tonic water, or some kind of mixed drink to make the drink tasty, so it also increase your sugar. And that result, so our recommendation is stay away the spirit, to be honest, okay? Now, who do I know? I always like to I always like to walk out. 我又中意飲煎嘅喎，咁 OK 咧？咁其實咧 ，to be honest 咧，依個又唔係 OK 嘅，因為咧，依啲酒咧，全部咧，有機會令到你嘅血壓可以好高，或者可以好降低，亦都啊、呃、令到你本身咧，你血糖咧，好多時咧，唔知道你係咪會令到你血糖高或者低啦？佢仲有一個影響一個你咧，你個 insulin 啊。你個血糖咧，胰島素咧，係會令到胰島素唔係咁 work 嘅，或者令到佢胰島素咧更加出多胰島素出嚟，咁你個血糖咧就會降好低，咁啊低血糖啊，咁幾樣嘢咧，依啲係好難 predict 嘅 ，predict 唔到，咁所以變咗嚟講咧，會令到你個即係成個血糖嘅走勢都會好差。仲有一樣嘢，你飲依啲咁嘅啊烈酒咧，多數啲人咧就中意叫做 cocktail mix。For example, gin tonic 啊，或者飲其他嘅 cocktail mix 啊，咁你揾 vodka 再加啲甜嘅誒、呃、東西撈埋佢一齊，咁咧你依個咧亦都提高咗你血糖，所以變咗亦都唔正仔，所以變咗嚟講咧，飲酒烈酒真係唔正，所以其實最後咧你就係 end up 一杯靚嘅紅酒，一杯五安司或一百四廿二秒係 OK， 烈酒冇滯啦。Well In conclusion, that is really a red wine, one glass, wonderful. However, I would not suggest you to drink whiskey, vodka, all the high concentrated spirit. I don't think that will be good for you. Okay. Last but not least, one of the things I have drink. Vegetable juice. That would be a very good suggestion. So, what is vegetable juice that you can drink will be very good. Vegetable juice, for example, like celery or cucumber, which is uh, two are very good uh, vegetable juice to be drank. And a lot of people say, "Wow,、well, maybe that will be blend." So you can put few pieces of berries. To adding more flavor for you,、uh, blueberries especially, and that can be very delicious, and it has good vitamin and also good minerals. So that is something that you should able to get that as a juice to help <coughs> you to get、uh, a, a choice. So, for example, you drink celery juice. You have 170 mil. You have three grams of carbs. Okay, a lot of fiber, good antioxidant, and also anti-inflammatory properties. Wonderful stuff. Okay, cucumber juice has half a cup of cucumber juice. You're gonna have two gram carbs, 34 calorie, and that are very good stuff. And if you can actually mix them together. And get a very nice juice to be tasting. Okay, it's good taste, and you can add a little bit,、uh, you know, uh, uh, berries to make it 
taste better. Okay. 嗱，其實咧，如果唔飲呢啲嘢，啊，頭先所講咁多嘢，仲有咩飲啊？係咪飲 fruit juice 好啊？其實唔係 fruit juice， 係蔬菜汁啊。因為飲蔬菜汁咧，好似譬如西啊，依、这個啊啊啊西芹汁，同埋咧。你有一個啊，即係西芹嘅芹菜啦，同埋啊依個 cucumber 黃瓜啦。咁呢汁咧係兩個都好嘅。咁西芹汁咧，或者依個叫芹菜汁，好多人叫嚇、啊。你其實飲咧一百七十 ml 裏邊咧得三 gram carbs 嘅啫。咁又裏邊好多啊啊啊啊纖維啦，又有好多 antioxidant 啦，抗氧化嘅東西啦，咁幫助你咧，你能夠抗抵抗發炎嘅嘢啦。咁如果譬如皇家咧，即係 cucumber 咧，亦都係只係得兩 gram 嘅 carbs， 同埋三十四個 calorie for 一百七十 ml， 同樣東西好好飲。如果你想加多啲即係 flavour 落去咧，攞幾粒啊啊 blueberry 放落去，咁樣一齊飲咧係好正仔嘅。其實我朝朝早都飲依兩樣撈埋一齊嘅，咁其實就好好飲嘅依個嘢。亦都幫助你咧，係 lower 你個 carb， 亦都係一個好健康嘅東西。<coughs> Excuse me <coughs>。So cucumber actually is a significant has not lower your carbohydrate. I mean, uh, has low carbohydrate, but actually also is a, a a good drink to detox, to bring back health balance. And top of that, it actually is a clean up your system. So actually, drinking cucumber can be a very good、uh, drinks to balance、uh, your <coughs>、uh, health. Because then, 咧黃瓜咧 cucumber 啊，能夠咧係啊第一低啊依個啊啊啊 carb carbs 啊，第第二樣嘢咧係即係幫助你咧。係誒趕除咗好多病毒嘅東西嘅，其實依個叫金埋好正嘅東西嚟嘅。咁所以其實你撈埋依兩樣嘢飲咧係好正嘅。同埋如果仲有一樣嘢我都講過啊。如果夜晚咧，哇！我好想食餅乾啊，我想食 chips 啊，誒、呃、做一個、呃、snack 啊，其實唔好食餅乾 chips， 你 cut 啲 salary， 即係誒芹菜啊，條咁大條嘅，擺雪櫃雪凍咗去，去照依個咧。係好正好正，或者就算啊，跳金啊，照一條條都係好正。如果你中意有 cheese， 擺啲 cheese 落去一齊食，亦都係好正。依個係一個 good snack 嚟嘅。咁你問啦，喂 ，fruit juice 好唔好㗎？其實 fruit juice 咧，其實好似即係 soda 一樣，你飲一個 fruit juice 咧，係有二百四十個即係 calories 嘅，個 carbs 好鬼高嘅。咁其實咧就唔好飲。Fruit juice 同 soda 揸唔得幾遠嘅 ，so your question may ask, hey, how about fruit juice, orange juice, apple juice? How about that? That is almost just like regular soda, high carbs, not good for you. And especially if you are on an airplane, you don't move. A lot of people say, wow, you know,、uh, most other people offer you orange juice. That's almost like drinking sugar water. So don't go for that during an airplane ride. Apple juice is the same thing. I'd rather you have some, maybe a little more tomato juice is actually better than the other two, ap apple or orange juice. Another drinks is so important. Avoid those energy drinks like Red Bull. Red Bull are full of sugar, full of caffeine. They actually increase your sugar tremendously. So try to lower the Red Bull. You know the Red Bull drinks to get your alert energy. That's why they need you to go alert energy because it gives you a lot of sugar, a lot of caffeine. And but that Red Bull also create one more bad item. It give you insulin resistance. So the study all shows that. So stay away from Red Bull. I'm not doing it, but wait. Also, I just want to the energy drink. Ah. 你叫咩有個紅牛啊？紅牛啊 ，drink 咧飲落去啊，咁裏邊好多糖喎、啊，同埋仲有一樣嘢，佢有一樣嘢係能夠令到你個胰島素啊係啊、呃、有 resistance 嘅，咁令到你胰島素 resistance 咧有好大劑啦，因為點解咧？你出多啲胰島素，嗰啲糖都入到去個個個 cell 上邊。
咁呢樣嘢就希望你真係唔好有呢個東西啦。咁最後就係、是、第一，我要揀，如果唔中意啊，即、就、係、是、我有咩能夠適合到我哋有呢、這個。啊啊！有依個去到啊啊，能夠令到我飲啊嘢係幫助我係降低我血糖咧。如果有糖尿病病者，我係誒唔可以飲好多嘢降誒升嗰個血糖嘅，或者我係前期患病者，亦都唔會啊啊令到我係升嗰個血糖係飲咩飲咧？第一當然啦，希望你揀。呢、这個去糖茶啦，或者其他茶啦，去糖茶真係會幫助你降低血糖，呢、这個好重要嘅，幫到你。第二可以飲水啦，第三係飲啲唔會有糖嘅水分啦，好似啊 carbonated water 即係、啊、加咗 carbon 啊,啊 CO2 嘅茶、啊、水亦都得嘅，或者用啲大骨湯啊，同埋咧或者有啲係。啊、uh, ，almond milk 啊，即系啊啊，或者系 coconut milk 啊，呢啲咁嘅 nut milk 嚇、啊、幫助你。咁同埋仲有咧，就可以啊，係咪有啲蔬菜汁啊？同埋咧，就真係少量嘅紅酒。嗱、啊，當然啦，好多時有啲人就話我飲 red b u l l 我都要做嘢嘅。咁飲 red b u l l 咧係好差嘅，有 insulin resistance， 同埋咧係令到你係唔會。啊，即系俾咗好多 caffeine 啊、糖俾你嘅，所以依个就唔好饮啦。OK， 嗱 ，in conclusion， actually， it's very simple to drink things that is keep in mind. No sugar drink or very little sugar drink will help you to lower your blood sugar and keep you healthy. And that is considered will be like、uh, low sugar tea, the tea that we created to help you to lower your blood sugar, lower your cholesterol. You can drink it ice. You can drink it any way you want to. It will be perfect for you. Second, you can drink water, and you can also drink、uh, unsweetened、uh, beverage, which is like carbonated water. And also, you can uh, uh, drink uh, eat uh, drink、uh, you know bone broth. It will settle your stomach for afternoon, and、uh, also for your uh, uh, midnight snack. And also nut milk like almond milk, coconut milk, soybean milk, and certainly vegetable juice like celery juice,、uh, cucumber juice, and small amount of red wine could be recommended. But I highly not recommend to drink like a lot of alcohol. So today that is our seminar, and I thought that maybe perhaps、uh, we have、uh, some question, and I will. I have one question here. Is that is that recommended maximum of sugar we drink? Okay. Ah,、uh, I already have a question. Ah, by Lorraine Young. Ah,、uh, and she was asking a question. Is there a what kind of、uh, maximum of sugar we drink? Now, ah, I also used English to answer that. Actually, sugar tea is recommended to drink six、uh, glass a day. You should drink six. A cup of day of eight ounce cup, which is two hundred forty mil per cup, so six. And you should drink it before lunch, or、uh, before each meal and after each meal. And you can drink one more uh, after uh, after uh, your meal or two cup after a meal is okay. Low sugar tea itself has two things in there. The first thing is guava leaves. Guava, guava leaf it block the sugar entering your bloodstream, and as bitter melon, it is helping you to、uh, bring the blood sugar into、uh, the cells. Plus, it is hundred percent natural, so you do have to load your blood,、uh, load your stomach with some. Oh, a、uh, low sugar tea before you eat dinner will give you the best effect. Now, what happened? I'm saying, hey, I'm going out to eat buffet. I am really eating a lot more, and you can use actually instead of two bag a day, you use three bags a day, meaning that you're gonna have 
uh, one bag in the morning, you drink it three times or four times. Lunch time, you do one more bag of those shoe tea or three times. You drink, you know, because you can steep it three times. Every time it's 250 mil. And dinner, you do the same and three bags. As that is especially the time you eat a lot of food. You as like uh, uh, like medication. You increase your uh, dosage to uh, help you to decrease your blood sugar. So that's a very good question. I have a friend called Lorraine. So he asked me, can I drink more blood sugar tea to the doctor? So actually, in our country, every day, we should drink six cups of blood sugar tea. Before we eat, we should drink a cup of blood sugar tea. After we eat, we should drink a cup of blood sugar tea. So actually, we should drink a cup of blood sugar tea every day. So you should have a good effect. So actually, we should drink a cup of blood sugar tea every day with 250% of blood sugar tea. 咁但係好多時咧，我哋咧要去食布菲啊，或者食多啲嘢咧。咁其實咧，你可以飲三包茶，然之後每日飲兩包。朝頭早飲一包，就可以飲三杯茶。晏晝飲一包，又可以飲三杯茶。夜晚飲一包，又可以飲三杯茶。三杯茶，咁令到血糖咧就會降低嘅。咁呢個係一個。可以講得為，即係好似食藥一樣啦。如果食多啲嘢嘅時候，咁我飲啲茶多啲咧，咁我就將血糖降低，咁令到令到你咧就唔會成日令到血糖高嘅。好似琴晚我話俾你聽啦，嗱，琴日咧我係食上海菜，咁我咧就食咗好多嘢嘅。咁我特別係用多啲血誒、呃、血糖茶，飲多啲嘅時候咧，我咧個血糖咧係升咗幾多啊？去到十就翻翻落嚟啦，冇升到上去啊，所以係好好嘅。同埋血糖茶咧，係百分之一百天然，仲有裏面有咩啊？冇咖啡因啊，所以飲完瞓覺一樣咁好 ，excellent。There's no caffeine in low sugar tea. You can drink any amount will not affect your sleep. So this is so wonderful. And you can drink more, especially you can eat if you have to eat more. You should drink eat a little bit more. I drink a little more low sugar tea. Will definitely help you to lower your blood sugar. And like myself, last night I went to a Shanghai restaurant, I ate a lot, so I drank a little bit more low sugar tea. My blood sugar just went up to ten and came back down very, very fast. The important thing is don't let yourself with long period of high blood sugar. That is the challenge. And with low sugar tea, definitely will help you. Okay. Are there any other questions from last meeting? Uh, or uh, let's see. Uh, okay, one of the questions, very interesting. Uh, they was asking, can we eat the black bean soup as a dessert? Black bean soup. Now, uh, black bean soup is actually uh, black. Actually, not black bean. Black sesame soup as a dessert. Okay, black sesame uh, sesame soup is actually that can be okay if there is no sugar. It's okay if there is no sugar. Unfortunately, a lot of black sesame soup has a lot of sugar, plus it has a lot of oil. So you can do small amount. With no sugar is okay, but not a lot, not a big bowl. Then you'll be all right because you don't want to add the sugar to increase your sugar. That will be uh, not uh, recommended. Okay, are there any other questions? I, I, I saw some questions earlier. If you ask questions, you can uh, come in and then we can help to answer uh, more questions for you. Any other questions from the group? Okay, if there's no question, uh, I appreciate you spending your valuable uh, Saturday morning or eve uh, Friday evening to listen to the seminar. I hope you learned something. If you like the seminar, can you give me one, 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 a lot of one inside and I take a look, see whether you think that this seminar helped you uh, 
uh, and also uh, help you learn something. Well, I saw a lot of one. Okay, that's real good and perfect. And then I hope that uh, we'll give more of this seminar to at least help each us, each all of us to better understand how to prevent uh, uh, diabetes uh, and uh, get you better healthier uh, health. So even though you are pre-diabetic, you will not convert to be a serious uh, a diabetes or you already diabetes already, not converting you to be a very serious diabetic. So again, thank you very much. I appreciate you spending time with us. I would love to continue to have this ongoing seminar and hope that you will continue to get healthy, lower your blood sugar, and enjoy health. Thank you very much. Have a good weekend.